better remember so you don't have to today. We're gonna be looking at Doctor Who. And for those of you who don't know what Doctor Who is, I'll give you the skinny. Basically, Doctor Who is about it's a sci-fi show about a time lord who travels through time and that can regenerate, which means he can change his face and his appearance. Whenever he changes his appearance, it drastically changes how he feels. Like, for instance, if he was dramatically happy, like overly happy, the next one he'll be more serious. But today we'll be talking about the modern era, which starts at the 8th Doctor. Yeah, there are 8. Yeah, there's like 13. Yeah, there's 13 Doctors. As of this recording, there is now a woman, a lady Doctor. Yeah, they could change his gender. Weird. So yeah, this guy was the was the was the new guy. Hold on. For simplicity's sake, we're gonna be talking about a Cyberman. And for those of you who don't know what a Cyberman is, I'll tell you what it is. A Cyberman is essentially one of his enemies that they upgrade each other, which means they literally kill people to live out their expiration dates. Yeah, this show got morbid when it wanted to. And it was happy when it wanted to. So don't be surprised if there's some sick moments. Why am I reviewing this dark edge comic when I usually review happier things? Well, it's because After reviewing so much happy, I just want something dark. I just want to bring on the depressing. So here's the scene where I would be screaming and shouting. About bring me the depression. But I already have a joke in the bot in the link below to tell you. Hold on. Sorry, my demonstration broke. Here's a Dalek. Exterminate. Yeah, these are also villains of the show, but we're not talking about them today. We're talking about... Cybermon. And like I was saying, here are the Doctors. That's number 12. That's number 10. And in the TARDIS, you can see is number 9. And up... Up the TARDIS is the 11th, played by Peter Capaldi, David Tennant, forget his name, forget his name. If you remember, I also reviewed another comic like this. But it was as edgy. You can read that little excerpt. Through a mirror. This is essentially telling the tale of how the doctor well, got to where he was. With a big cut room. Now, I feel like I've seen this before. Like the falling of the Doctor. But it doesn't seem like it's going that route. We skip ahead to one of his earlier incarnations, the 11th, who was funny. David Tennant could put on a show. He really could. Here's a good idea of what the comic was about.
So they're just recapping from all the other happenings of that the Doctors were happening. Oh, and remember that Cyberman head. It will come. It will come in handy later. Oh, the ninth guy, who's took Norris, basically. Here's his face. Here's David Tennant's. This guy's who slipped my mind. And a cartoon, Peter Capaldi. They're essentially coming for a cult. Our comic ends with them telling about what will happen in the next few issues. This is just a show. I'll be actually doing a recap review in another review. This is just a show of what I'll be doing. So, until tomorrow, I'm the critic. Or today, I remember so you don't have to. Bye.